Good morning and welcome to Diggin' SoCal. This is going to be my first hunt in the state of Washington. So hopefully we have some good uh, finds today. I'm going to hit the tot lot first and then there's a soccer field next to it. So let's get to it. And I got my uh, first target over here by the swings. That's what we got here today. It's 5.30 in the morning and it's chilly. Oh, yeah, first finds a penny. Nice, bright, shiny penny. All right, my uh, second find here is closer to the swings. Kind of weird. 12, 13, and then I get a one. Those are some weird numbers. Oops. Okay, I see metal. <clears throat> That's pretty cool. It's a pendant. And it looks like it could be geese or sw a swans. I'm not really sure about the numbers though, 12, 13, and then a one. I'm not sure what that's gonna be made out of. Not very cool. All right, getting a uh, 29, 30 right here. Probably just a quarter, but I've cleared about half the tot lot so far and haven't found a whole lot. Whoa, that is not a quarter. Wait, is that metal? Yeah. Washington Lottery. The hole on that side. What's on this side? <laughs> Problem Gambling Helpline. <laughs> That's pretty cool. All right. That's a first. Good thing it doesn't say uh, Problem Metal Detecting Helpline, because I'd have to call that number. But uh, I'm good here. Well, I had a number 14 on the uh, Vanquish, and uh, about an inch down, I pulled up this uh, steely steel ball. I don't know what they use these for. I used to use them with a kid as a uh, slingshot ammo. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's pretty heavy. All right, I uh, finished off the tot lot with just a few finds, and I'm over here working the grass area. Got a quarter so far, and I just got a 22 hit, and I got a key. Let's see that. National something here. National Lock Company out of Illinois. Cool. Hey, a nice little uh, 22, 21. I thought I was going to get a penny. And I got a really rusted uh, Allen wrench. Haven't had an Allen wrench in a while, and I think that's the first one I've dug out of the actual grass. All right, I was getting like a 17 here, and I got a uh, earbud. I probably just ripped the other part off because it's really stuck under there. All right, well, I had a 30, and it wasn't about two inches down, maybe three. And it's definitely not a quarter, I thought it was. Looks like a dollar. I can't quite make it out. Looks like a Sacagawea. All right, I'm at park number two in this area. I'm getting a uh, 2425 right here. The only thing I see around the slide, you know me and the slides. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Whoa. Holy smokes. Wow. That's a nice ring. That is really nice. 
Let me uh, go off camera here a minute and see if I can see what this says on the bottom. Score, man, that's awesome. Okay, so I brought my eyepiece this time. I'm getting smarter. And uh, it says J-P-S-T-E-R. So I'm thinking the S-T-E-R is for sterling. So it probably isn't a real diamond. But if it's sterling silver, that's pretty cool. Could be a um, CZ di diamond, but I don't think it's going to be a real diamond. I can't test it till I get back from this trip, but that is really cool. Getting a uh, 1617 right here. Okay, I have a ca I have a cat. Interesting. Okay, that works. Not really sure what that's from. I almost thought it was going to be a Monopoly um, piece. Someone's little uh, metal cat. A little weight to it. Well, this came up as a 17. It's broken. A makeup case, it looks like. Huh. Must be the foil on the bottom of it. Got a little excited there for a minute. Thought it was going to be something good. Alright, I think I have another first for me. Um, this came up as an 18. I don't know. It's metal. It almost looks like one of those things I used to use as a kid where you put caps in it and then throw it. I'm not sure. It's not one of those lawn darts because it's metal. That is really interesting. I will have to clean that up and take a look at it, but I'm guessing it's a cap type uh not really a gun but something you throw because it's got the little spot here that it gets pushed in that might be old that is really cool i'm going to clean that up and get a better look at it wow that's pretty cool i think that's even better than the ring i found wow man these targets are making me work today this is a uh, 19 and it was kind of long so i almost passed it up but uh, I got the tip of it up. Check this out. Pills. I'm trying to see what this is here. Pillsbury, bro. I'm not really sure. Um, probably clean up. I'll go to try. Nice. So, that was my first Washington State hunt. Um, hit one park on the field together, and then I hit a couple small parks. Had a great time. Did pretty good. Um, maybe I'll hit the lake tomorrow and then call it a wrap for my little trip here and then head out to the coast. But uh, definitely was a uh, fun day's hunt. Probably three or four hours total, including driving time to the different parks. Anyway, let's do the wrap up. And thanks for watching. Okay, so here are my finds today. Um, crescent wrench, pencil, typical stuff, nails, screws, washers. Um, this is a uh, shell casing. I don't know what uh, caliber it is because it's broken off where the caliber number was. Um, battery, this little clip right here. And then, um, let's see here, this steel ball. Got some weight to it. Earpiece, this is really cool. I had one of these as a kid and I cleaned it up a little bit. I could probably clean up some more. I don't know how old it is, but you put a cap in there and then you toss it in the air. And since the nose is heavier, it lands on that little front piece and it pops a cap. That's really cool. Some uh, pull tabs, just odds and ends. I did find $1. And then I found about, uh, I guess 10 quarters, about six dimes. I may be at, uh, what, two, four, six, eight nickels. And then my pennies are over here. There's about 40 pennies. 
dug a lot of pennies at the park. That was crazy. And then I've got the, um, the little key and a Washington lottery token. Doesn't even feel like metal, but it uh, definitely read up on the detector. And then I've got a uh, swan pendant. That's really cool. Could be silver. I have to test it when I get back. And then I got this cat, which I believe is Monopoly uh, a piece. It's the only thing I can figure out. The feet are flat, so it does sit up uh, on the feet. That's pretty cool. And then the ring. Definitely scored on the ring. Um, it is uh, sterling silver. Doubt the diamond is real, but it's probably a CZ or something like that. But that was really awesome to find that. So there you have it. Pretty good finds for my uh, first Washington hunt. Very happy with it. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet. I will catch you on the next one. Thank you.